Howe trying to find a way through. He did really, but uh, Cook went straight back in, straight back into trouble. Now Powell again, he is a goal kicker, does the discipline thing. It centres it, Uze and Green. Great mark. Green takes the mark, and he is a real goal kicker. He's kicked 16 goals for the year, but really has had limited opportunities in the last few weeks, though that has really changed, and he has become a real option for them up forward. He's played 14 games, but a lot of them would have been on the interchange bench. Yeah, a lot of courage too, young Brad Green. The good thing about that, eyes were on the ball. He didn't move away from the football. He knew quite well he was going to back in a bit of trouble, took the punt, and his eyes stayed on the ball and was rewarded with a great mark there by Brad Green. I saw him last week. He kicked three or four goals. The good thing about this young fella, he can kick the ball nice and long as well. well we saw him here against the Kangaroos about three weeks ago, and he just pinpointed three goals through from similar accuracy required straight through the middle and he's done the job well that's a good start there for the demons and uh, no doubt today there'll be a big contest in the ruck daniel bandy i have a lot of time for as an on-ball ruckman's got the job on jeff Watt, who's been in outstanding form and there's a discipline thing i think as you called huddo about squaring the ball up there instead of having a shot there stephen powell has had an outstanding year Ooh. and the courage there from brad green was just absolutely brilliant his own teammate i think it was adam who's they cleaned him up there as well and a brilliant goal by him green the goal kicker too far out to score Swartz might be a target doubling back, but Neat's coming out. Pavlich with him. Swartz doing the roving. Johnson is clear. Just on the ground. Good pass. Right good vision too. And Green takes the grab. That was just good football by the Melbourne side there. David Swartz to the trying to kick the ball over his shoulder. Fed the handball back here to Travis Johnson. As you said, Ado, just came on the ground. Last week he got Polax late in the game when they played St Kilda. And that was just great vision by Travis Johnson. He's, a, he's an exciting young player. We talked about Brad Green earlier. He's kicked 1-1. One, one. And he has a habit of taking marks directly in front of goal too. So that's to his credit. From 30 out, he Kick. slots it. Melbourne answer back with a goal. Well, they have been struggling uh, so far in the second term to just break loose the uh, Dockers. I mean, the Dockers have lifted their work rate. They've put enormous pressure on the midfield. Once again, as we said, David Swartz twisted and turned and feedback handball. And that was an absolute brilliant kick by Travis Johnson. Set up Brad Green for his second goal. He's now been picked up by Dale Kicker. That's a very good sign, Doug, don't you think? You know, that he's, he's prepared to just be aware that there are other people that are in a better position to kick the goal than he. Yep. He could have a left foot snap there, Jeff Farmer, yeah. to make seven goals. Brad Green, I think, is coming from the ground to give Russell Robertson a run. Green's now has kicked three goals and been a very player in their full line. But you're right. Well, you, you wouldn't lay odds that he won't kick seven anyway, would you, with another well, quarter he might plus kick four ten. minutes? He might get ten, yeah. this bloke. Double figures. That was good, unselfish football yep. by Jeff Farmer. Yep. Team yep. football. Disappointing, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs>